that is members from the Kenya Chamber of Mines, Tanzania Chamber of Mines, Congo, Rwanda, and South Sudan. Uh, we are working together uh, as an East African Chamber. Stakeholders in the mineral and petroleum sector have predicted that Uganda is to become one of the wealthiest countries in the region once large-scale industrial processing of minerals begins. In terms of a proper reserve for gold, they are putting up a formidable largest gold mine that the country has ever had. So we hope by next year uh, we can have an official opening of that mine. Because from the days of claim, this is going to, for me, the first day for a country to say, yes, we have a mind worth talking about. A commissioner at Minister of Energy and Mineral Development in charge of license administration, Vincent Kedi, says an area mapping of mineral wealth in Uganda indicated abundant valuable minerals underneath that include petroleum, gold and rare earth among others. Because Uganda is richly endowed with a variety of mineral resources, you know them including uh, marble, gold, copper, cobalt, tea, uh, tungsten, iron ore, uh, beryllium, limestone, salt, phosphate, graphite, lithium, rare earth, the list goes on and on. This was disclosed during a joint media briefing also addressed by the chairman of Uganda Chamber of Mines and Petroleum, Sir Richard Henry Kaijuka, together with the Minister of Energy and Mineral Development, about a forthcoming two-day mineral wealth conference set for next week. Uh, we are going to talk about women in mining, and that is a, an emerging issue. We want to spend some time on the artisanal miners. We'll talk, uh, and the chairman hinted on this, about the green minerals, and the critical minerals, basically. We want to deal with issues of the environment and climate change, and how it affects the mining and vice versa. Our mining. Henry Kaijuka, who is a former minister for energy and mineral development, explained that Uganda is abundantly gifted with minerals and commended government for banning exports of unprocessed and, minerals. Uh, rare earth as, as, as a very addition policy. For some of you who may not be familiar with the rare earth, is one of the critical minerals. These are 17 elements, remember. By the time you separate them, we are talking about a big investment of over a billion dollars. The Mineral Wealth Conference will have participants from Chamber of Mines and Petroleum from across East African countries, and it is to be addressed by experts in the mining sector. We've been conducting exploration activities in Eastern Uganda for the last 10 years, it's actually over 10 years. And uh, we are present in the, in the districts of, of, of Ugweri, Mayuken, Ujiri, doing exploration for rare earth. Uh, I'm Navka Farida, and Deo Habimana.